Next and final stop tonight, Northern Ireland and Rachel O'Connor. I'm from a village called Drumstone in Derry, Northern Ireland. Never lose it. Hey, look at that. My family is sports mad. It's either golf, rugby or football. It's an obsession. And then oh, head up. there's me. <laughs> I've just let them down. She couldn't play rugby, wasn't very good at hockey. If you played this game with us, you'd be part of the family <laughs> instead of singing in your own your room pair. <laughs> A singing superstar is something that I can put up with. <laughs> <laughs> my granddad, he's a big inspiration in my singing. When he was younger, he was in a band. I love to hear her singing. I bring a tear to my eye sometimes. <laughs> I just want to travel and pursue my music career. I think that's every parent's dream, that their children fulfill their own dreams. I'm only 16, and to be on stage in front of four huge names in this industry is absolutely surreal. This is my dream. This is what I want to do. I can't imagine myself doing anything else has to go perfectly. There she comes. Watch this. You don't believe this. You don't believe this. How good she is. I'm 16 and I'm from Northern Ireland. You're wonderful. I'm a fool. I should have turned around. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> if you need advice on who to pick, just give me a holler. <laughs> Wait, I gotta do the rain dance around. what I was just dreaming to hear and then to see. <laughs> you were so moving, touching the purity in your voice and beautiful song choice. Thank you. <sighs> I would love to work with you. That's all I'm saying. Thanks. Well, I loved it. I think you sound original. 
as young as you are, you, you've already found yourself, I think. And, and I would like to help you to take that further. If possible, so... I mean, I, I, would, I would love to have you on my team, and, and, and that's, that's from there, believe me. Thank you, Tom. Hi. Hi. <laughs> it was great. It Thank was really, you. really good. Your confidence on the stage just poured over the back of my chair like a tidal wave. <laughs> I still can't believe people turned around. Do you like Ricky? Yeah. Um, <laughs> so, would you need my advice on him? <laughs> Only if you save me. <laughs> There's the female choice. The best choice. <laughs> and Carly, I've worked with her in the studio. She knows exactly how to take you where you want to go. She's the bomb. <laughs> but I've also seen Mr. Jones in action. I mean, he's a legend, right? Every trick in the book, he wrote. <laughs> <clears throat> Ricky. Ricky knows how to nurture and protect and guide, but Kylie would be amazing. That would be spectacular right there. Um, the thing is, these two, they're superstars, and, you know, they live in a different world. <gasps> We'll get, we'll get you there. It's just, it is a long journey, and, it's more, and I don't want you just to take that leap, because you, you have to get there and not be carried away. All I can say is, join my team, and we will have loads of fun. It was my idea to cut my hair the way I cut it, so don't listen to me all the time. <laughs> and I still got the tag on my hair. Don't listen to me, you don't listen to me. the tag on your shoes as well. That's because I'm returning these You're after I finish the show. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Kylie. on the voice. <laughs> it actually happened. It's like a dream. Like, it, it doesn't seem real. It still hasn't sunk in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 